What's up, YouTube? It's your girl. Back at it again with Prince of Persia, the Mask of the Darkness with the DLC and everything. You already know what it is. You clicked the video after all, didn't you? I hope you read the title because the title actually told you in the description. There's a link to my battle pass, but like it's a limited, limited edition 50% off on the battle pass. So you better um, you better act now. You better act now. Get on my battle pass, all right? But how are you guys doing today? I hope everybody's doing great. She looks magical, actually. That looks awesome. <laughs> I get to one-shot things. I feel so strong. I feel like I, I, I feel like I made an accidental, really overpowered build. But yeah, I'm enjoying this game so far. Last thing we did was mostly exploration, right? We killed one boss last time, and we got um, we got new. We killed the snake guy, right? And the snake guy was really... He was probably one of the coolest boss fights so far. I'm really into the, the animal boss fights in this game. I haven't really fought many of the human ones, except the only one that was super memorable was Valbon. Oh my. That's cool. Dude, what a cool area. I like the music here, too. But yeah, feel free to comment down below, hit the subscribe button, you know, if you like content like this, if you like stuff like this, if you like Prince of Persia, do do your thing. I'm going to get really, really into this. This place is kind of magical. Like, genuinely really fucking cool. Fucker. I'm good thing I have like a million potions. Oh, the fire is a hazard too. Okay. Okay. Oh, the walk walk tree. Hello. Oh, and a fast travel. We can go upgrade some stuff. A whack whack on a ship. <laughs> We've seen everything now. Trees. Any trees to patch up their boats. They don't <laughs> care what's whack whack and what's not. Okay. I haven't used the level. No, I've used the level three. The level three is really sick. Let's go back home. I kind of wish there was just a button to... Oh, there is a button. <laughs> there is a button. Never mind. I was like, I wish there was a button just to go back to the Haven. Because I have to scroll all the way up. And there is. I just had to look at the screen. But, like, that's really hard to do. The whole actually paying attention thing to the game that I'm playing. <laughs> what? That's crazy talk. Welcome. Uh, yes, Mommy will help you um who what do we want weapons or bow i think bow honestly i'm kind of enjoying the bow a lot it's not like a unique kind of weapon but it does do shit <laughs> what's up blood how are you baby how's final fantasy 7 rebirth you gotta fix that on your stream blood you gotta fix that shit for me. For me. Because I'll be watching your stream. And I like your stream. I like being there, bro. Bro, I like being there. But, like... I gotta turn you up so loud. I gotta turn you up so loud, bro. I gotta... I gotta turn up my speaker all the way up. Turn you up all the way up. Turn on my Google Chrome extension that increases the volume slider. And then I can hear you. I was like, bro... <laughs> I mean, it worked after I got everything. <laughs> it worked after I got everything going. <laughs> but yeah. Fuck that. Nah, dude. Anything for Boo. <laughs> anything for the homie. You know, the, the moment I was like, blood is streaming, I'm a... I'm a watch no matter what. You can't, you can't stop me. You can't stop me. You're gonna look into this? <laughs> yeah, I know. It was mad quiet. It was mad quiet, but it was good still. Your, your like quality on your stream is really good. Like other than that, like the um, the visual quality is actually like insanely fucking good. I don't know exactly what settings you're using, but caught me those settings. <laughs> caught me those settings. Cause your shit's fucking like really crisp. Bro, I've got so much health now. 
How am I supposed to die in this game now? That's crazy. Can I like... No. <laughs> I have to scroll all the way down. To the raging sea. Let's go, baby. Let's get this shit going. Let's get this shit. Let's get this shit. Let's get this shit. Let's get this shit. Get this shit. I can't just go down there. Okay. <laughs> oh, thank you. You don't know why. You like to use the first Elgato and fucking run it. Maybe there's something in your OBS settings. I think so. Because it looks, it looks crisp. It looks really good, actually. Like, the visual end. Oh, how am I supposed to kill that? I don't think I'm supposed to kill it. I don't think I'm supposed to kill it. Oh. They're like platforms. Shit. Shit. Oh my god. <laughs> Never mind. This is the Dark Souls of fucking platforming games. What the fuck is this guy? Okay. He doesn't get stunned. Nice. I have to actually fight him. Oh, fuck. Missed my parry. Wait. That's not fair. Oh, shit. Okay. Okay, so I have to like air combo him or something. All right, dude. Thanks for coming by. Thanks for being here, BB. I hope things are going well. I hope you're. I haven't talked to you like directly in a while. I hope your foot's better. Cause I remember you broke it like a while ago, right? I hope you're feeling better, man. I was not paying attention. Dynamic entry. Oh wait. I want to do dynamic entry. Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. Doing that real quick. I can definitely do this, right? Oh fuck. Okay, I got I got the strat. I think. I think there might be a different strat we can use. No. Okay. Oh my god, I was trying to like be fancy to like delay it enough. I've already lost all my health. <laughs> all my health potions just to fighting that one guy. That's crazy. Oh, fuck. I didn't realize that was a bad thing. What the hell's down here? It's just the floor again, right? Yeah. That's just lightning. Okay. Um. Sure. There's something up here, but I don't think I can go up that high. Not only is the audio low, it's fucking delayed, really annoyed. Why you don't know why it's doing that? I've heard a l you have you're using like an Elgato, right? So you're using like a you're using like an in between, right? Like you're using a is it like an internal or an external card? Because I think that's a pretty common problem with um, capture cards in general. Is that like you kind of have to reset them after a while, like every like hour or so or else they like delay mine does that too oh shit i tried to do my super holy fuck that was kind of sick oh they're comboing me they're fucking comboing me shit they got true combos and i got hadoukens Nice. 
I, I, I popped my super and I won. <laughs> Fucking wasted that shit. I love how fast I am in this one, though. Actually, really cool. Can I pick that up? Thank you. What is this? The comb of the princess? Nice. <laughs> is out of sync from the start? No! Yeah, that's the worst. That's, that's like... I'm gonna have to like figure out what I'm gonna do whenever I go back to streaming like my Switch and stuff, because I had that issue on my Aver Media as well, where I had to like after a little bit of time I had to always like un I had to like the delay would just get worse and worse. I think Elgados tend to have like an inherent delay, so you might just be able to delay your picture on the stream. Like delay like the output of the picture. And then I think you'd be fine. Because I think they don't like fuck up that much. But my Aver Media would just like gradually get worse and worse. So at first the delay would be unnoticeable. But like after an hour or two it would get so bad where it's like uh. Yeah. So like the game is unwatchable now. Because the the cutscene voices are happening two minutes later. Or some shit for everybody. They're like wait. What the fuck's happening? But I also love it when games fuck up and that just happens. I think it's funny. I've had I had that happen with um Dragon Age the other day where it just like the cutscene just got desync. There's another game I played where like frame rate was tied to the cutscene or something. And like my frame rate dropped because of a loading screen or something. So the audio was like the audio got like really, really bad. Oh. Oh wait, that's that was the the fire that it hit. I was really questioning. Oh, I wonder. I really want to do this. Okay. Oh, it, do it did just like kill him. Dynamic! Oh, wait, no, sorry. Dynamic entry! <laughs> there you go. One shot him with the fire, that's sick. If you're clever enough. You don't know how to... Gotta throw some trash out and stuff and look into this, I guess. Hope you can fix it, otherwise I guess I ain't streaming it. <laughs> No, nah, bro, stream it anyway. Who fucking cares? Who fucking cares? You care. But but I care that I get to see you. So it's a win-win. Do let me get in here. Oh, that's sick. This game's so fucking good. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> that lightning will actually reset me to the beginning of the area if I touch it. That's why I was like trying really hard to not get fucked. Watching shit delayed and ha audio is shit and not grading view experience you will stream. You'll just play something else. I mean, you can figure it out though. I think you would just... I think the best option is just to like, you know... Fix up your audio, which shouldn't be too hard. There's um, there's settings in OBS that will help you. Like my microphone is really, really quiet actually, like insanely quiet. But I have a lot of settings that I've changed on OBS to like make my my mic sound loud enough. There's still some issues I have with it, but it's better. It's better that people can hear me, you know. Whereas like if I had it like on bass and I turned off all my filters, you would not be able to hear me at all. And I think you could just like delay the um I think you can I think there is a setting where you can just filter it where your game displays like, you know, 50 milliseconds later on your stream. And then it would be probably in sync with your um with your, you know, your delayed audio that you're getting. Oh shit, what am I supposed to do here? God, what a fucking sick game. That that's what I would think might fix it. Now I'm I'm not an expert, but <laughs> I am no expert. But if you if you want help or like you want to figure it out together, like just hit me up sometime. I should be available tonight if you're like not working tonight.
Apparently there's something there, probably. I feel like I can get above here, too. That's fine. We're gonna keep going this way. Oh yeah, I have to hit this with a charge attack, right? No? Chakra? Huh. I just have to hit it a bunch of times. Okay. Sometimes you have to charge attack them. <laughs> really? Holy fuck. Do the juggles. This game just plays like Tekken, that's it. No, I'm kidding. This game's not like Tekken. It's more like Smash Bros. Oh my god. I was so early there. Oh, fuck. Shit. Got him anyway. Got him on the reverse beat. Uh, go. Dude, I can't believe there were so many tarantulas outside today. I was just like, I was about to go to the gym. I was about to go outside, get my mail and stuff. And then there was just like tarantulas all over, <laughs> all over the apartment building. I'm like, yeah, no. Yeah, no. I'm no. I'm good. Some fear factor ass shit going on outside. Nope. I'm staying inside today. I don't care. I don't do spiders. Usually, I'm not. I'm not into like. I don't like bugs in general, but but spiders are a no-no. Oh my god! Fuck this guy. There's a treasure chest there. He has a double hit. I have to remember that. I keep missing the parry on him too. Like not the. Not the counter parry, but the, um... I keep missing the other parry, like his initial hit. I'm just like not reacting to it. It's such a fast attack, the whip. Compared to most of them. Most of the attacks in this game have like a decent wind up. Okay. Okay. Motherfucker. I should kill him, yeah. <laughs> it worked! It, the combo worked, sort of, right? Ooh, what? I was not paying attention to the dude. I'm just gonna auto kill him with the super. He's not even gonna die to it. The super was not even strong enough to stop him. Oh fuck. I won, eventually. <laughs> I could have died there, that was really awful. There's a chest up here. Hey, dude. Nice. Bro, I feel like I'm so strong right now that I'm, like, not even worried. Let me get up here. Okay. I feel like there has to be something above somewhere. There has to be some sort of secret going on. Dude, I can't believe they got Keanu Reeves to play Shadow. 
in both the movie and the game. Like, that's wild. That just means in canon, in the real universe. What? Wait, why is there a lock? What does that mean? Oh, shit. He's locking me out of my, my supers if he hits me with lightning. I'm like, there's like an electrocuted status. Oh, fuck. I just realized that. That means Keanu Reeves is just canonically Shadow the Hedgehog now. I don't know how to feel about that. <laughs> I don't know how to feel about that. I'm not too attached to the original Sonic like voice actors anyway, but... But Hollywood. <laughs> Hollywood coming and taking over. At least it's Keanu though. Keanu's cool as fuck. I love him. I love the John Wick movies so much. There's some of like the best shit. Dude, I still remember going to see John Wick 2 and 3 with Nero back in the day. That was the shit. I remember John Wick 2 and 3, we went with my ex-girlfriend and my ex-girlfriend just could not watch them. They were so brutal for her that they just made her like hide behind her hands like it was a horror movie. It was the funniest shit ever. I'm looking forward to this. Not bad, kid. You managed to get here. A fight between two immortals. And no one to see it. <laughs> Let's get this over with. <laughs> what a fitting end to you, Orod. Look at my cheeks, bro. Coming out. I got that thong on. Hi, Orod, the Storm Master. Challenge Sargon, the Betrayer. <laughs> Dude, I like him so much. He's like my favorite fucking character of the bunch. Show me the true spirit of the Russia bar. <laughs> I hope I hope we don't actually kill him, kill him, but you know. Oh, command grab, he's Angief. Holy fuck! I'm gonna go super mode real quick. See what we can do. Okay. Oh, I have a slow-mo if I like dodge like last frame or something. That's crazy. I tried to do it like a frame perfect. Okay. I actually can't be on there even if I dodge. There's no blocking. There's no blocking the command grab. Oh. That's sick. Oh fuck, I was trying to do my super there actually. Shit. Okay. Oh fuck. I don't know his moves yet. Oh, I parried that. I'm like going through this. Never mind. Oh, fuck. Okay. Oh, I was trying to like go through that. Dude. I'm so dead. Holy fuck. Got some like screen attacks, full screen attacks going on. I think I know how to get through this though. Oh shit, that's a command grab too if I get in there. <laughs> Holy fuck. Oh shit, I'm dead. <laughs> this game's so fucking anime. Holy shit.
Oh shit, I was actually just out of that, barely. I cannot do that. Oh my god. He's actually kind of tough. Come on, give me everything you've got. Yeah, I can't. I have to super through that, or I have to get out of it. It's one way or the other. I can't be in there. I was trying to like dodge a fancy way, but shit, that hits fucking hard. Okay. I don't think I timed it right. Oh no, we're fine. That's so fucking cool, dude. Oh, I get a get a fucking <laughs> I get a fucking quick time event too. Oh fuck. Damn, okay. I see how it is. We did kill him, right? I don't want to kill him. I like him. I think we fucking killed him. Oh no. I've drowned the Bahamut and the Caspian Sea. Cross the hell bridge of Shinmat for a bet. <sighs> Crushed Hercules. No one sang about it. But you, you gave me the most glorious fight. Did you kill Hassan? What do you think? <laughs> Don't fight the current. Learn to sail in high winds, kid. Dude, I like him. I don't want him to die. That sucks. I'll miss you, brother. Bro, I liked him as a character. I thought he was cool. They get a new surge. Oh, fuck. Bahamut's Rage. Unleash a large and devastating whirlwind attack that throws light foes in the air and smashes them violently to the ground. Very effective against large groups of enemies. Can only be triggered from the ground. Level 3? Cool. New level 3 super. Oh, shit. We get to keep going. That was a really cool boss fight. I like the implementation of like having to use a time mechanic to get over the, um, the like tornadoes. It was just kind of hard to figure out on the first go. And he, he his moveset doesn't really change that much. It just becomes bigger. As you go. Is that it? A secret? Over here? Okay. Fine by me. Fine by me. Um, I think there's... There has to be something over there somewhere. Let me remove this. Okay. I'm missing whatever this is. I have no idea where the fuck to go about this one, though. But that's like the last thing I have, the last treasure. The other stuff is like lore stuff that I accidentally like did not find. 
at all. I think I can get over here now that I have double jump too. What's this? Oh yeah, I can't go there yet. Can't go here yet either. What was this? Um, I got angry, I think. There's some reason we why we couldn't go up here. I forget why. We might have to go back there to figure it out again. Oh, what was this again? A great, yeah, with the Xerxes. Um, that had one of those things I don't understand how to do yet. Okay. Hmm, I might... I think I can get up there now that I have double jump. So I think I could go back here and try to figure out here. I obviously need to get here somehow, but there's, that's only an escape route. So I feel like I should be able to go here now. I don't really see a different route because I can't get in here. I don't have whatever key or whatever that's trying to get me to do. I can't go here yet. Yeah, I think that's like the only route that's open. But I felt like there was a thing like I think I needed the um, the power though, right? Like the other time power. And I don't have that time power yet. I'm not sure where to find it yet. What does it tell me? Yeah, summon the four celestial guardians. So I should be able to do that, I would hope. But without the time power, it would be impossible, I think. G give me back my health and shit, bro. Thanks, bro. Oh, down here. Teleport fast. Um, so is there any treasure that I can get quickly? I, I got most of the pit of the Eternal Sands done, so we're happy with that. Um... I feel like I can get most of the treasure here now, too. In the Soma Forest. There's a part of me that just I really like. <laughs> I really like hunting for things. I have to do it. Where is the room? It's all the way up here. Yeah, because I couldn't get it without double jump, right? Okay, cool. And then where am I supposed to go? Just go straight for a while and then go up. Oh. I had a, another jump there. Dude, this game's like so pretty too. I go up here, right? Yeah. I needed a double jump to get up here too. <laughs> <laughs> it's all just collecting it with a double jump. Dodge on the spot using a spot dodge. Oh. Interesting. Kind of like, I don't really see the use of it when their parries exist. I think it might work against the non dot, like the non parryable attacks. That'd be cool. Because the non parryable attacks would be, are kind of problematic. Oh my god. Mister! You're supposed to die. Yeah, enemies can parry you too. That's why I keep trying to put them in the air, because if I put them in the air, I kind of get to do juggle combo against them. And I also have like increased juggle damage. Oh yeah, I unlocked this power the other day. This is going to be a Xerxes, isn't it, or something? Oh, no, it's not. It's a treasure chest. What is it? Oh, an amulet slot. Nice. Sick. Cool. That was totally worth going back to get, actually. Amulet slots are huge. What the fuck was that? Do they actually, like, fuse together? Or something that was crazy looking. He like growled at me. Oh yeah. This room. How oh, fun. Do 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 do. Okay. Now where's the other one? There's another secret I wanted to like try to get 
I think it's this one over here, right? So the fastest route would be the one closest. Soma tree, right? Yeah. Because I feel like with the double jump, I'm not going to be able to get that much more distance. So I should just be able to... I think I'll be able to do it. I believe in myself, so... That's usually all that matters. <laughs> That's right. I was trying to pick up what the bomb. Like that, but I... I had my, my stock taken up. My bomb pod stock. So I just like bombed myself by throwing the bomb into it. Oh yeah, puzzle room. This one was fucking annoying. It it's a good puzzle though. It re it really makes you like a lot of those puzzles. You have to be just environmentally aware about what the environment's trying to tell you. It took me a while though, because I had to like. I had to figure something out that I didn't feel was super duper obvious. Yeah. Okay, I can't get back there yet. Um, okay, well, we have pictures of everything here. Um, I can go turn stuff in there. I can go do the DLC if I'm lost. Um, what was this about? I think... I think I've solved that from now. I think I solved that. I think we're okay. I think we're a okay. There's some areas I haven't explored here yet, but that's okay. We're gonna go complete. We go down. We can go down, and we're gonna try and find our way to the next <laughs> celestial guardian. I have no idea where to go though at this point. It's it's like when I was looking for the freaking double jump. I was just, I was getting a lot of the uh, the pickups, so I was also just lost as well <laughs> at the same time. Where I'm like, eh. I'll figure out eventually where I'm going. We'll, we'll find some secret. If we don't find some secret, we'll um, we'll definitely just <laughs> we'll definitely 100% the game as we go, just because we're gonna we're just gonna figure out the whole map. That makes this game feel a lot like Symphony of the Night, where it's just Symphony of the Night had like a light direction you're being put your point being pointed in but it's still like you just wanted to you mostly just wanted to explore regardless of like how you felt you just wanted to be, keep going because if you kept exploring you just eventually find the next thing to do okay now where do i want to go i do want to go back here i think i might be able to buy some treasure maps and those treasure maps are really nice because I just, I kind of just want to get the treasure. Hi, Sargon. What's up, Farbia? Fariba? No, Catacombs map unavailable. I don't. Okay. I can't Where buy her you? map yet. Um, potion efficiency, sure. Let's upgrade our potions. Fully bought all of the upgrades from her. Nice. I'm gonna buy the the amulets too. Just so I have the options. The options for the amulets just feels important to me. I like I like having all the different like ways to like fight. Yes, and I think I can go down. I think there's a there's a purpose to going down here. I know there's like a side room here. At least it showed it on the map somewhere. Yeah, right here. I don't know why it won't let me go. Why well, didn't just go all the way down? But you know what? Huh? There's this the gleaming lion slightly increases Aether buildup for each successful parry. Well, I'm not really parrying that much. Sorry to sorry to burst your bubble, Chief. Most of my parrying in this game has been. I have a parry ability, and that parry ability lets me. Um, Let's me heal a little bit whenever I hit a parry. This is one of those rooms. Hee 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 hee. Mm. 
Oh god. I was teabagging. I didn't expect it to come and get me. Whoa. Okay, don't get one shot here. Heard. Oh, <gasps> you, you bastard game. Okay, I'm, I'm too scrub. I can't move fast. That was not fucking cool. Okay. Wait. Bro. I swear I didn't press the fucking button. Honestly, I thought for a moment my character just like phased through the world. It's right here, right? Oh god, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, okay. Okay. I have to go up higher. I could have waited for it to go lower. I just, I reacted a little too early. I think it's right here, right? There's a safe spot. And then what was it again? Okay. Like left and up. You could totally do this re reactively, so. Oh my god, that still almost fucking got me. I think this is gonna come from below, I bet you. I have a feeling. Yep. Oh god. Okay. I really could have just like teleported through them, couldn't I? This is gonna be like tricky, isn't it? Yep, told you. I was waiting for the fucking trick to come. <gasps> I was fucking looking at it. I ah, know. I was trying to cheat cheat it too a little bit. Oh no. <laughs> that was fucked. You know, game respect game, but holy fuck. Pen's right here, right? This one's fucked up. Let me drink a potion. I'm actually really, really low on health. And this is easy. I almost just killed myself there. That's how easy it is. I. I don't have the skill to um, pay attention. It's too easy. My my attention span does not work when it becomes too easy. Yeah. I have to do this for science sake, don't I? Oh. Holy shit, I can do that, okay. What's up, Medi? How are you, BB? This is a bad idea, ain't it? Oh god. Oh, fuck. They're trying to trick me now. Oh my god. Uh, fucking. Are you frilling me? They're gonna come from below, aren't they? Okay. Bro.
Bro, when the fuck does this end? Holy shit. When the fuck does this end? That took forever. I thought that was like over a while ago. And how the fuck do I get up there? <laughs> Bro. Oh. That's... That's fucked. That's so fucked. What about you, dude? I'm chilling. I'm chilling, dude. I had to clean my cat today. I had to give him a shower. That was brutal. I got new outfit though. New, new, new jorts. We're chilling. Lilac. See what lilac looks like? Skin. Rogue Prince. <laughs> Bro, looks like Grimace milkshake hit him. What the fuck? <laughs> Dude, what the fuck is this? Wait a minute. <laughs> How do we feel, Maddie? <laughs> Bro looked like he got hit by the Grimace shake. For real. What the fuck? <laughs> Who the fuck made this shit? <laughs> Jill, I'm about to play some League to exhaust yourself, then nap. Oh, shit. We work? Where, where are you working now? Crimson's kind of fire. That's kind of fire. I fuck with it. Sands of Time is just, it's fire. The blue and gold is fire as fuck. Lilac? That's sick. Coral? I don't like the white hair. I think it's killing me. And the red, the red is kind of like too red. Radiance, all right. And default's good. Cool. I'm going to do Sands of Time. Would I recommend this game? Yeah. Yeah, easily. I really like it. Welcome to the stream, Ravel Pret. I'm a little bit more than halfway through the main part of the game, I believe. At least if I'm if I'm if I'm to believe my completion percentage, right? My completion percentage, I've just I've been basically getting everything and getting lost, but it says I have like 63% of the game's collectibles or something like that. So if I believe that, I'm supposed to be about done with the game. I'm more done, than, done with the game than I am, like, beginning of, the, beginning of the game. And so far, the boss fights are all really fun. The game's really tough. And in some places, the platforming's really interesting. It's really, really engaging. There's, like, a little... There's a good element of, like, puzzle-solving mechanics when it comes to some of the platforming in the game. The aesthetics are really fun. The game's really pretty as well. I wasn't I was really not expecting to like this game as much as I do. I think this game is easily like there have been a lot of really, really good games I played this year. This game is easily personally in my regard. I like platformers and stuff like that. This game has easily hit like the top five games that have released this year for me. It's just really fucking cool. The combo system and the fighting system is amazing. You can do so much. And as you get more and more powers, shit gets crazier and crazier. It's fucking awesome. You're back at your old healthcare job? Okay, okay, cool, cool. Yeah, because you were talking to me about that. You were like, oh man, I'm thinking I'm going to go back to like like the old healthcare job. Because it, you know, it pays well. It pays really well, right? Your, the healthcare gig that you're doing. And it's like, it's like kind of annoying, but... But it pays good, and you get consistent hours too, right? You get like consistent hours, which is fucking awesome. Oh, he just booted me. That's fucked up. It could be a good game, but you think Little Nightmares 2 nailed it when it comes to the type of semi 3D net the graphics? I haven't played Little Nightmares 2. I want to play that game eventually. My girlfriend has told me a lot about it. She's like really into those kinds of games. Or maybe she was just drunk and over explaining it that one night. I don't remember. Oh fuck, he has a back step. And the fire does a lot of damage, doesn't it? Okay, I should heal. Oh shit. I tried to do something. Um, is he dead? No. No, he's not dead. I should have potion there. I use all my potions. Nice. Yeah, it pays good, but lots of benefits and such. You just tend to be there six days a week. Yeah. 
Yeah, that, that, that'll that do it too. Working too much fucking sucks. Oh my god, I just can't. He's still alive. Okay, shortcut. Little nightmares to you last year, and it's must play game for you. Yeah, I've heard really, really good things. I think Metro played it on stream like when it came out, too. I remember watching parts of it. I should play it eventually. There's just so many, like, there's so many good games to play. Like, yesterday I just finished Dragon Age Origins, and that game was fucking sick. I, I wasn't too big on the ending, the final boss is kind of meh. I was, I was expecting a little bit more out of the final boss in Dragon Age Origins, but other than that, the game was fucking super duper cool, super fulfilling. Oh, what's up, Legolas? You in and shaped you into an immortal. Var you turned against us. Varum is driving a wedge in a way. <laughs> you did Persia a favor. What do you even famine? Drought, unrest among satrapies, loss of Persian soldiers? Queen Tamiris' bloodline is unfit to rule. The people deserve better. The people deserve someone like Varum. Only the White Lion can restore the pride of Persia. Come back to reason, dignity, and purpose, Sargon. Damn. Elias, wait! <laughs> Damn, okay. Only really regrets is you played on the small screen for the Switch. Yeah. I could see that. It. I kind of like playing things on the small screen though too. It just really matters like what I'm looking for. Oh my god, this looks scary. Oh fuck. Oh, I have to do the whole thing in one go. Okay. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. I did not mean to jump there. I jumped on accident. I, like, fat-fingered it. I honestly didn't know these things went forward. I just kind of, like, jumped because I could jump. That was cool. It's actually a really sick, like, platforming section here. Oh. Um, okay. I'm kind of confused. Okay. I'm definitely looking for a checkpoint. So, I think I might go back down there. If I don't find a checkpoint here, I'd have to go back to a checkpoint way far away. And I don't see one. Is this a shortcut? I think that's a shortcut. Yeah, that's a shortcut. Fucking huge. Awesome. What's the Forgotten Sands? Which one is the Forgotten Sands? I've never played a P Prince of Persia game. This is like... This is actually my first one... I played, I played the Sands of Time at a friend's house, but like, you know, like how you play a single player game at a friend's house kind of vibe, right? Like your friend's like excited to show you the game. They're like, oh, bro, you got to see this. It's so fucking sick. Look at this thing. And then they let you play it for like five minutes because they're on a boss or something and that they can't get past. And they're like, oh, yeah, dude, I'm just kind of like stuck here on this boss. And then, you know, you, you, you try it once and you've never played the game. So you just instantly die. And you don't know what the fuck's going on. Oh like, yeah, dude, this game's sick. Cool. That that's how I that's that's about all I did it with Sands of Time. I my friend showed me the game at his house once. And I played for like five minutes. <laughs> I didn't do much, but 
it seemed cool. But I never had a Xbox or a... Um, I never had a PlayStation or an Xbox console. I only ever had, like, the Nintendo GameCube. And the, the um... What's it called? I only had the I only had a Nintendo GameCube and a, a Nintendo 64 growing up. For the eventually eventually got like a Wii, right? But those were the consoles I had when I was growing up, so I never got to really play a lot of the like quintessential PlayStation or quintessential like you know Xbox games. I did get to play Halo. These are secret rooms, usually. Yeah, yeah, there, There's a trend. Okay. There's a thing here. Cool. Prince of Persia, The Forgotten Sands was the first popular, pop, proper 3D graphics game, which needed one gigabyte graphics at the time. That's cool. That's a cool fact. Yeah, I, I did not know that. I wasn't a PC gamer either until, like, much later. I think I started becoming a PC gamer. Um, I know I played World of Warcraft. So like, I'd say like 2010. 2010 is when I started like getting more into PC games and then like I kind of made the full switch during the PlayStation 3 generation. That's when I became just like, I, I just only play on PC for the most part after that. I want my potions back. I'm so low on health that I don't want to go up and just instantly die. I feel like that's going to make me sad. So I'm going to go back and go get our potion. Go go get some potions. Even if it's a little bit further away, I'm not going to be bothered by it. I love this game. It's fucking sick. Just having these all these different abilities that allow you to do different things and like go through everything that's cool you brought you bought your first switch in COVID at the age of 22 nice twenty two during COVID so you'd be about about my age right like 26 25 right now that's awesome yeah I'm 27 I just turned 27 this year well Previously this year, like five months ago at this point. That's crazy how time flies. Let me get over here. I I wish these elevators were more like Dark Souls elevators. That I think that's my my main gripe with this game. Is that none of the elevators are like Dark Souls elevators, so they don't save the location where they were pre where you let them go previously. So you have to wait for them. <laughs> If you're not on the right side where the elevator starts, you have to wait for them to come down and it just feels kind of silly. Maybe I'm just too Dark Souls brained, but setting my elevator where I want it to be and just like going back to it is almost second nature to me now. I, I don't like waiting if I can avoid waiting. Huh. There's something here that I can do. Yeah. Okay. Definitely something. I feel like I'm gonna have to weigh it down with something or there's some like platforming gimmick here. I do not think this is how you're supposed to do this, by the way. Like, I I'm 100% sure I cheated that. Like, I don't, I don't think that's how you're supposed to do it. 
But, you know, I, I'm clever sometimes. I'm clever and very stubborn. Okay. Oh, yeah, I can try my new power up. I have a new, like, super. I wanted to try that one. And I have one more slot on my amulets. Moderate amount of damage taken. Now I can do a two slot though. Significantly increases my attack damage of my surges. That sounds fun. That sounds all right. I'll try that. Oh, and fast travel. <laughs> I don't think I was supposed to get up here like that. I really want to know the actual solution. Do you think I can get up there? No. I feel like I can. Hmm. Ah, barely short. I feel like I can if I'm stubborn enough. I feel like I, I feel like we could break into it somehow. But I'm gonna, I'm just gonna give it space and just move on from for now. Oh, is this a, okay, no. I thought that was a room that I've been to before. Yeah. Oh, that's really sick. That's cool. Okay. Unlock the door. There's a lot of shortcuts in this game, too. I <laughs> parried so early. It's fine. Kill him. Kill him. Who cares? I won't. Oh fuck, that was bad. Sick. What is this, an ingot? Nice. But yeah, no, I've been gaming for like a while. I just recently did Dragon Age, which I was surprised that Dragon Age is like aged as well as it, as it has. I'm going to start Mass Effect 2 tomorrow, which I'm looking forward to. It's been a while. I didn't expect Dragon Age to go for as long as it did. Dragon Age ended up taking me like, what, like a month and a half or something? I think. It's a long game. I think I did like 40, almost 50 hours just on the base game. Another one here, down, up. Oh my god. Okay. That was spooky looking. Okay. I'm just trying to make sure I unlock the doors. <laughs> so if I die, we're okay. Um, how do I get in there? I have to get above over there somehow. I also like there's a whole mechanic where you can kind of take a picture of parts of the level and it puts a marker on your map so it tells you where to go back to, which is so fucking nice because in any platformer, there's always issues where it's like, oh, you have to backtrack, but you have to backtrack later. And unless you're taking notes on your own map, it becomes kind of annoying. Where in this game, it just lets you take a picture of it. Which is fucking awesome. Holy shit! Menelaus, what the fuck? Listen to me. Varum killed Hassan. I won't believe anything you say. Good eye, sniper. How can you say that? Varum is betraying Persia. We are warriors, so that one day others don't have to be. Varum is the king to end all wars. A king would oh my not God. kill his subjects. Help me stop him. Varum has an ideal that is bigger than you and me. Ryuga Wataki Gakurai. Wait. You're Wrong game. My bad. No choice. <laughs> That's fucking sick. <laughs> That's really fucking sick. Holy shit. I 
can destroy his mines though. Okay, got it. Shit. Oh, he has like a Renfuk in there too. Fuck. Got lit up there. Oh, and he has like an immunity there for so often. Yeah. I kind of just immune through that by chance. I could have parried that. A lot of his moves aren't parryable. Oh, fuck. Can I parry them? I don't think I can. No, I definitely cannot bury them. Okay. Sometimes you can parry the mechanics like that, and it's really cool. After all these years, all those battles, no one has pushed me this far. <laughs> what the fuck did he just eat? The sun soul or something? Oh. Oh, that's a counter stance. Oh shit. <laughs> it's like a literal fucking like Kamea. Oh, he can counter it. Okay, cool. That's really good that he can fucking do that. Fuck. I barely dodged that shit. Oh no, not the counter. I fucking was... I was going in on him too. I was like, bro, I got this shit. Fuck. Oh, that does so much damage. Oh, I need to heal. Oh, I got hit. Oh, the parry actually works really well there. I missed. Shit. Fuck, dude, that arrow hit me into a the, like star he put behind me. I almost had him in the first try though, so pretty good. Shit. I should have, like, teleported to him. I'm setting up that teleport for a reason, too. So, the reason why I'm setting up the teleport is so I can, like, close distance from him, because he keeps, like, he keeps hopping from side to side of the screen, so. But it's really funny how that teleport also stayed on the screen. I would have had him if I didn't try to, like, parry this and troll. Like, you take a lot of damage if you miss a parry in this game, or if you try to parry an unparryable attack. I can't believe he has a fucking parry. St he has a parry stance of his own that then does a fucking. 
like Kamehameha wave. Like that's crazy. He just like goes fisticuffs here too. That's so sick. I'm like half scared to try and combo him because that's like that stance is fucking terrifying. This might work. It doesn't do major damage though, but it does work. Shit. I'm trying to set up there. Oh, missed my parries. Yeah, I keep jumping into that attack too. Think this works? <laughs> no, I still got hit by his fucking shit. Oh fuck! Just had a command grab, and these things are slowly closing distance on me too. That's fucking awesome. Oh fuck, I have to parry that. Okay, that's really fast too. Oh shit, I really wanted to hit that. Hopefully this works. I'm trying something different. Oh! Fucking A, dude. I do not have, um... I do not have a, uh... Holy shit. I'm really scared he's gonna like... Fuck. Fuck, dude. I was really waiting for that too. Oh, I have a moment. I have a chance to fight still. Okay. Fucker. Oh, this is it. He, he dies. Okay. Okay. Dude, what if I die to the fucking counter? Oh. All right, this is, I get his counter now, right? My own Kamehameha wave? Oh, shit. <laughs> That's sick. I was feeling a little bit OP, but each of these bosses killed me at least once or twice, so I'm not worried about it anymore. to push you this far I only relied on this bow because I was weak a true warrior needs no weapon I never wanted this fight <laughs> this is kind of cheesy me neither a sargon <laughs> <laughs> then why'd you fight me and tell me what the fuck is wrong with you, bro? <laughs> not not a good storyline. In terms of the delivery here a little bit. He's like, I never wanted to fight you. It's like, neither did I. Well then why don't we try to talk it out? Uh well, you know. He's he obviously is like so manipulated about like thinking I killed the prince, but like Yeah, it's still I still don't like it. New ability unlocked. You can teleport to your chakram, hold it, and then press that to. Really? Dead oh fuck! That's cool. Why does it have to be this way? And I get a new super, right? Ronchu's judgment. What does this look like? I haven't even got to try it yet. Oh, that's fucking sick. Oh shit. Okay, I'm gonna try the counter now. I wonder if the counter is gonna work against like just regular enemies or if it works against like bosses too what if i can do like that big counter on like 
like a tiger boss or something. That'd be crazy. The scorpion. Yeah, so what was this? Okay. I think I can figure out how to get up there. And I have this teleport. And that teleport's gonna go crazy. Now I can like get to all sorts of weird spots. The the game can no longer stop me. I wonder if I can get through things with that too. Oh. Oh, that allows me to do that though. That's crazy. Okay. Now let's see how we can get up there. Because we need to get up there too. Huh, wait a minute. Huh? Uh, huh? What the fuck do you mean? Does this work? Oh shit. I guess that was where I'm supposed to learn that. Nice. Just a regular old treasure chest, but you know what? We got it. Where are the things? That's just a route between the two areas. I'm not too worried about that. So our last one's over here, which we need to go through here now. Okay. Well, we, we figured it all out. Sick. I just need that last, like, time ability. So I can unlock the last little areas. Now I want to get up here. Because I really wanted to get up here. Now I can do it. Oh, I told you there'd be shit up here. Sick. Oh, I can't go that way. Was there a faster way? I don't think so. I think we just have to walk there regularly. Yeah, no, the fights in this game go crazy. I like the environment too. And I like the art direction they went with. The cell shading makes this game. This game's going to age extremely well. No matter like when <laughs> when people end up playing it. I don't think that that's yeah, I don't know if I did the secret here right or not. Like, I think I did it wrong. I'm like 100% sure I did this wrong. But you know what? It worked out. It worked out, so we've... <laughs> but I'm not... I'm Now I'm not sure if I did it wrong or not. Oh, fucker. I need to shoot arrows at them when they're spinning. When they're spinning like that. What if I just did that? Oh, it instantly collects it. Oh. Oh, I can't parry from behind. I'm just fucking around, aren't I? Could care less. Health doesn't matter anymore. Um, it says there's something up there. So I should probably try to get up there. Oh. What if I what if I was supposed to go to the other side first and that unlocked an ability? So it would have been easier for me to get around in this area. But I went the other way because I cheated. <laughs> That'd be so funny. I wonder. Oh. Hello. Shit. Fuck. That's really intense. Oh, wait, this is me going at it backwards, that's right. I don't know anymore, actually. What the fuck? No, that wasn't backwards. That was a secret. Okay. We got another health bar for that. <laughs> Worth. Oh, I was trying to like <laughs> I was trying to like move secretly. Okay, now where do we go? 
I says I haven't been down all the way in this corner yet. I don't think there's going to be anything else, but you know, we might as well check. Menelaus. Yes, we killed Menelaus. That was our <laughs> our previous guy we killed was the the bow boy. Shit. Get up here and ooh, a chest. Cool. What is it? An amulet? Um, what I get? Void blade. What the fuck? Send a direction, an energy wave in the direction of the attack, dealing slight damage. That's sick. That's really fucking cool, actually. That's kind of like, you guys ever play a Zelda one? In the original Legend of Zelda. So long, alone, just waiting. So many strange sounds. I like her design a lot. In the original Zelda one, you would get um. If you were at full HP, your attacks would be a beam sword. And that beam sword did like crazy damage. So you wanted to stay at like 100% HP as much as possible. Oh, this is one of those rooms. The challenge boss room. Oh shit. Oh, it's like a charge. Oh, fuck. Holy shit, that does a lot of damage. Okay. Oh, is that it? I was expecting a little bit more, honestly. I thought it'd be a little bit more going on here, but whatever. Holy fuck. That is... That is intense, bro. And it charges back really quickly if I don't, like, attack. The builds in this game are kind of intense. I wonder. <laughs> I'm <laughs> sorry, but I wonder. Yeah, I definitely can't get up there from here. <laughs> but it would be really funny. Oh, shit. The old man's here. Hello. The Simor Gate is beyond these palace doors. From there, you will have access to the Hall of Divination. The way is impassable. Oh, hmm. Well, it won't be for future, Sargon. <sighs> <laughs> Oh, Rockman. <sighs> Shit, okay, okay. I see. Oh, another one of those things I have to remember. There it is. Never mind, I don't have to remember. It's right there. Oh, but there's multiple. There's multiple locations to put this in. Ain't that the worst? No. Can't I just do this then? I don't really need... Oh, I can't ball jump there. Okay. This is kind of well thought out, actually. Kind of cool. Um... Well, I can't do that yet. Did I remove all the markers from over there? Yeah, I did. Okay. There's a secret here that I can do now, I think. Oh, hello. Hello, buff boys. <laughs> the fucking pillarmen from JoJo's. This game's sick. Oh my god. I tried to parry, but I used. I brought my guy out. Oh, I gotta get up there somehow. I, I think it'll be pretty easy. Oh. 
Oh shit, that pushed them way back. Boom. I can just like beam, beam sword them until they die. <laughs> the beam sword doesn't do an intense amount of damage, but it's cool that it like adds to like my repertoire of things that happen. And it does, it does give me an option if I feel like I can't hit an enemy. So I, I'm a big fan of it. Let me down, let me down. I want to go down. Um, hello. There's apparently a walk walk tree down here somewhere. Um, this is going to limit me. Oh, but this takes me back, right? The upper city west where that tree was. With the fucking bird persons. God, do I not like these guys. I'm just going to... Hello! Dude, as I get better at the combat and like exploration, ex explorationing, yes, explorationing all over the game. This game's fucking awesome. Did anybody watch the Sony State of Play? I feel like Sony, after Concord and after the PS5 Pro, like got fucking dusted. They feel they 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 know they fucked up. They had to show so much shit that looked good because they're like, oh yeah, that's right. Uh. The things we we're gonna show slowly in case a PR nightmare happened. That PR nightmare just fucking happened, and we're gonna show fucking everything now. We're gonna even include free DLC because um, Concord and the PS5 Pro were received so fucking horribly. I totally agree with it though. Like eight hundred dollars, nine like a thousand dollars for a PlayStation. Fuck that. Holy shit. That's like more expensive than my girlfriend's computer that I built her. She was like, I really want to play on a good, a decent computer that can play like most games and like has, you know, and I can play like the games I want to play on like better graphics. And I'm like, okay, cool. Like I made her one for like not even like $500. I had some spare parts lying around. Holy shit, that guy worked me. I had some spare parts. Like I was going to get rid of my, um, my graphics card, my old graphics card anyway. So so she got my old graphics card, which, you know, saved a, a quite a bit of money. But, you know, a 1070 isn't like that great of a card I anyway, but it's still like it's still kicking. It's still kicking. That that 1070 is like a Founders Edition 1070 cuz I got it right when it came out. And it turned it lasted me forever, man. I used to stream on that thing for, for so long. Everything else that I streamed was on that 1070. A 1070 is like... <laughs> Ten, the 1070 was fine. It's it, it seems to serve her well. She doesn't seem to have any issues with games at all. But like I'm sure in the next like couple years or something, she'd be looking for like an actual upgrade. But... And it's definitely not like PS5 Pro levels of good, but you know, it gets the job done. And that's all you really need. I can get up there. Huh. What am I trying to do here? Because, like, I can solve this. Like, it's not a problem. I don't even. Like, yeah, I don't need to do that. <laughs> you don't need to do that. I don't think you need to do that at all. I think we're okay. So what, am I supposed to, like, put the clock together? <laughs> Is that the way? Okay. Interesting. That's really sick. I really like that. That was fucking cool. I wonder why they don't make triple A PO Prince of Persia games anymore. I think they're just like 
Ubisoft's kind of really dropping the ball when it comes to trip like their triple A games. They're like big their big games they've been releasing. Just in general. I don't really think there are many like the Star Wars game didn't look that interesting. I hope it's good, but it didn't really catch my interest at all. Oh. Okay. Yeah, do a quick swap. Okay, got it. But, like, I think the only other AAA, di like, Ubisoft game I'm into is The Division. I don't really think there are any other ones. Like, I know a couple of my friends really like Assassin's Creed. But I'm not a big Assassin's Creed guy either. Okay, is there something I'm supposed to be doing here? Oh. Oh. Huh. This is fucking weird. How do I keep these down then? Because like if I move. Are they all on the same like timer ish? I feel like they are. It seems like they kind of are. So I'm going to hold this here until that's about lined up and then we're going to line them all up. Okay. You only pay attention to Assassin's Creed? Yeah, I feel like... I feel like those are the only two that people have been talking good things about are, like, Assassin's Creed and, like, The Division. And The Division's, like, kind of its whole own niche of a game for people who like that kind of game. It's not really, like... It's not really, like, a game that everybody likes. You know what I mean? It's, it's a looter shooter. Like, I like The Division a lot, but that's, like, a totally other thing. I have no idea what their other, like, triple A releases have been. I think they, they make The Crew, right? <laughs> that um, racing game? I don't play that. <laughs> I don't play that game either. Fully upgrade the necklace? Oh, shit. That's That means I have all slots on the necklace. Shit, how far in... <laughs> How deep into the game am I? That's crazy. Anahita. Sargon. Your blade was sharper than mine. I should have been better prepared. Oh, they have um they have Rainbow Six Siege too. I like that game a lot. Like a lot, but I've I've heard I stopped playing the game when you when they stopped it where you couldn't um you can't cook frag grenades anymore. You can't hold them until they like you know, until you want to, like, throw them. And, like, it, whenever you throw a frag grenade, it always has the same time that it takes to explode. You can't, like, you know, hold it until you want to throw it and then let it explode when it explodes. Like, on the timer that you throw... You when you, you don't pull the pin until you throw it anymore, right? I think that's how it works. And that fucking Why sucks. Did you... Why did you kidnap Princess Sun? There, there are a couple of other things. I've just kind of, like, lost interest in playing Siege, but... I really like Siege. I think it's a, I think it's a really cool game. I followed Queen Tamiris's orders. I can't tell you why, but I still need to finish my mission. Your mission cost her son's life. No need to drive the knife even further. I was loyal to a You never taught me how to deal with such defeat. No one can stand up against Dude, I would pay survive. I would pay full price for this game though, Ravel. Like First I know this game isn't like a full price game, but like I I think this game is good enough for that. I don't know yet like, if it will work. This totally outshines most of their catalog, which is fucking crazy. Then let me help you. I can't trust you. I understand. This probably means farewell. Farewell. What's up, Mugen? How are you, baby? I hope you're doing well, man. Oh my god. <laughs> it's fast. <laughs> I <laughs> just want to, I want to climb up. Oh, is that it? Was it just to get over here? Okay, that's sick. But this game doesn't have the POP feel, although it has POP feel. I can, I can see that. I can see that. I, I wonder a little bit like 
what you mean by that as well. Because there's definitely like... Do you mean it's just like a 2D platformer or do you mean like... Because I know like the old, like the first Prince of Persia is a 2D game, right? And then there are a couple of other ones. But most of them are like 3D, right? And the ones that people have played are like the 3D ones. Hmm. I can just die. I can just die. If I die, I'll get there faster, so hopefully we'll find a secret. Death will be a good shortcut. We'll be able to do everything we want and get through it. Oh my fucking god, are you kidding me? Like, I also haven't played any of the Prince of Persia games. This is, like, my first one. Not all about 3D. It looks more like Metroid than Prince of Persia. I could see that. It definitely does feel like a Metroidvania. Well, it is a Metroidvania. That That's why it feels like a Metroidvania. It definitely is a Metroidvania, you know? Where, like, the level... The level designs being open and stuff is the main point here. I'm not going to be able to get up there, am I? I can do whatever I want. The game can't tell me what to do. I still don't know what those are for. Hmm. <laughs> you can't tell me what to do, game. I'll figure out my own path. I was, I was waiting for a boss fight, but I guess there isn't a boss fight here. Have I played Metroid Dread? Not yet. One of my buddies has recommended that one super heavily to me. And he's told me it's like one of the best 2D Metroids that has ever been made. Of all time. Maybe that means I'm supposed to think about... Maybe it's a hint. I think it's a hint. I think it's the game telling me to use the chakram to get up there. I don't think so. Sorry, I'm like... In my head right now. Oh. I keep pressing the wrong button when I mean to parry. Is it like use the chakram to get up? It might be. That might be like what that means. It might be like a hint. If it is a hint, then I'm able to get through here, right? I'm going to try it. I'm going to try my idea. I would really like to do Metroid Dread though eventually. Do I do like Metroidvania games a lot. I'm a lot more into like I like Symphony of the Night a lot though. Yeah, no. Yeah, this has to be something. It's probably a grapple. I bet you. Like a grapple point or whatever, like a grappling hook or something. Cause there's no way that's like There's no way that, that has to do with the chakra. I was hoping, I was hoping that was like the hint. I was supposed to pick up that, I'm supposed to use the chakra room and then like teleport to it and do keep going, but I think it's a grappling hook or something like that. That would make sense because it, it, I feel like just looking at that, I feel like I was supposed to swing from thing to thing, you know? Oh, she's got the map. She's got the map. Let's go. Holy shit. Okay. Yeah, I knew there was more. I just couldn't get further. Okay. Down here is something. That's a room. That's a marked room. Marked rooms usually have shit. You're on diet since three weeks, but your cousin forced you to eat chicken and drink Coca-Cola. Oh, no. How would... <laughs> How do they force you? I mean, it's hard to say no. When you're like, especially like three weeks into a fucking diet where you're like, man, I really miss soda right now. And he's like, bro, we can have some fried chicken and soda. Let's go. <laughs> you're like, oh, shit. Going to Popeye's real quick or something. My little brother loves Popeye's. 
Like that's like my little brother's lifeblood is Popeyes. I think his blood is their fucking sweet tea and his like bones are are made of Popeye's chicken. Like I'm not even kidding you. I think his bones and muscles are just pure Popeye's chicken. That's all he fucking eats. He will go there like every goddamn day. And I'm not even kidding. I think he's changed it a little bit now, but he's still he's still like the biggest Popeye's fan ever. Okay, I kind of want to go over here, but I kind of also just want to go down there. So let's just go down there first. That's like, dude, it's the craziest thing. That is his fucking like life, dude, is going to Popeyes. It's so crazy. We used to make jokes that he keeps the pop his the local Popeyes around him like in business because he goes there like every fucking day. We'd be like, yeah, you're going <laughs> like, <laughs> like he was such a regular. That the people who are newly hired just knew his order. Oh shit. Is this a rematch? Do I actually get to fight him? Step aside, Sargon. I'll deal with this. Thank you, Varum. Varum? Do I get to fight Virgil? Oh shit. I actually get to stop him. Oh, fuck. That's so cool. Two of you. Let me guess. You found some of those feathers. My visions were true after all. Whatever your visions were, I doubt you saw this coming. <laughs> Step aside, Hassan. I like how it matches the skin on both of the models. I feel like that's one of those things that any other development team would just fuck it up. Even less a king. Sargon, watch out! Oh fuck! You looking kind of cute, hey yo? You looking kind of cute though, Chibard. I need you alive. You need some of those cat ears on, baby. Who do you think you are? You are nothing without me. A stray dog is not worthy of these powers. <laughs> the of the Samorg were never meant for you. Bro. <laughs> any mortal. Bro has fucking force powers on his sword. Morgue is no more. Its powers are mine, and mine alone. One thing is, why is this motherfucker using a katana? Like, unironically, he's using a katana and he's holding it properly and shit. Now he's not. Now he's being a brute with it. But before, is that record? Wait, there's no fucking way. I don't believe it. He's got fucking judgment cut though. Like he is Virgil. Yeah. Holy fuck, that is your recording. That's crazy. Ain't no way. I think that is your like previous attempt. When you fought him the very first time. Oh my god. Dude literally is Virgil though. That's crazy. Okay. That's kind of just funny. <laughs> That's just kind of funny. I'm, I'm about that. No, he's actually Virgil though. What the fuck? Shit. What a cool fucking attack fight. Oh. Uh. He can reverse time too. That's crazy. My turn. Oh, judgment gut. Have to like shit. Okay, I'm not gonna be able to get much. Comes to stuff. Not only Japanese use katanas. I'm pretty sure. 
I'm pretty sure. And he's literally using Virgil's moveset too. Oh my god. Ugh. Um. Oh shit. I had to be in the air there. I didn't see the little line on the bottom. <sighs> Bro, it's a fucking weeb. Holy shit. I, I tried to parry that. That was an unparryable attack. My timing was actually good though. I'm not going to be able to get him in the air either. He parries shit. The time slow is crazy. Oh my god. I bet that's like a command grab too. Oh my god. I did not even see him. Should be phasing. Okay. Let me heal. I double healed? Nice. What a sick waste of my resources. I mean, I just didn't need it. Oh shit. Okay. Wait. A judgment cut? Dude. Fuck. I'm not sure how I'm supposed to like dodge that. Okay. Oh fuck. Oh shit, that was so fast. What's up, dude? Oh, I'm back. Oh fuck. Well, all right. Wait, what? I thought I dodged that shit. I was safe, I swear. I thought that was just a cutscene. No, he, I, I apparently did not, was not good enough to dodge that shit. Ooh. Weaved into that shit. Oh fuck, I was not ready. Okay. Another judgment cut. I'm just gonna play careful. Stop. Shit. Oh fuck. He does not take um you have to fight him in melee. Like he, he just actually parries your your ranged attacks without without any effort. Okay, what side is it gonna be on? Okay. Oh my god! What the fuck, man? How am I supposed to dodge that shit? Oh, okay. I'm dead. I'm not dead. Oh, he barely hit me with that shit. I was so close. If I didn't, if I didn't use the double potion there at the very beginning on accident, I would have had this guy. This is a really good fucking boss fight. Holy shit. He, dude, my arrows do damage back to me. I can't do them. Oh no. Like, he unironically just fucking parries them and reflects them at me. Oh, I tried to parry that shit. I thought I was getting better. Yeah, no, he actually just parries my shit. If I'm, like, not ready about it. What's up, Sizzle? You feeling better, baby? I hope you're feeling better. Look at this shit. Look at this shit, Sizzle. This shit's funny. 
<laughs> just fucking uncheats his weapon and throws him against the fucking wall. That's some shit. I need to heal. Ah, uh, Ren Pukin got me. That's right. Oh no. Dude, I have no idea how I'm supposed to dodge that shit. Oh, f this is terrifying. Okay, whatever. He's a badass, dude. He's literally Virgil. Like half of these moves are. I'm pretty sure I've I've seen a, I fought against this in Marvel vs. Capcom 3. Doesn't make it any easier. Virgil's one of the most unironically overpowered characters in that game. And I was never good against him, so. Like, I'm not sure how I'm supposed to, like, stay safe during that. That worked. Oh my fuck, dude. That combo just actually worked me. Dude, he has gray health. That's fucking crazy. I have to actually hit him. Oh, I got hit. It's dead. It's over. I I thought it was fine. I thought it wasn't gonna happen. Yeah, it won't let me heal. The game's like, you should heal right now. Idiot. I fucked up. Smash stage. Smash stage, baby. How are you doing, baby? I hope you're doing well, Sizzle. Hope life's treating you good. My god. Yeah, I'm not sure how I'm supposed to dodge that attack half the time. There has to be something that I'm just doing wrong. Like. Straight. I've already taken that much health. You fuck. Oh god, I'm gonna get killed. Yeah, there's no way. I kind of just want to reset this, can I? I can die, right? Like, he'll just kill me if I... <laughs> Never mind. My, my buddy's gonna keep him from killing me. I want to restart. Pretty much better, just hired. Do you know what you had? Like, what kind of sickness you got? Or... Was it just like a really bad, like, stomach bug or whatever? My turn. Unironically, right after my, right after you got sick, Sizzle, my girlfriend got really sick. But she got food poisoning because she ate something I told her not to eat. So it's her fault. <laughs> no. She she just got food poisoning. My arrow going through that shit. Oh my god, I was not ready. Yeah, she just got food poisoning. She ate like something that was moldy, and I was like, dude, don't eat anything that's flu that's moldy. And she's like, no, it'll be fine. I'm just gonna remove the moldy ones. I'm like, if it's moldy, everything's fucking moldy. Like, don't don't ever try. Oh, I'm fucking hit anyway. I'm cooked! I'm fucking cooked! Holy shit. Oh, dude. That's like the worst attack. Yeah, some people just be like, yeah, I'll just cut around it. Yeah, my girlfriend's like that sometimes. I'm just like, dude, no. But I will not like fuck with anything moldy at all. Like, if it has mold on it, I will not eat it. Like, period. Oh my god, I fucked up. I'm like losing my, losing my cool. Fuck, that's right. I'm fucking tilted. 
Oh my god. I almost just ate shit. I tried to parry the second hit. I didn't even get it. Nope. Time warp. My time. I'm getting hit because I was trying to close distance. Oh fuck. I need to recover there and I didn't. Okay, focus. I was early? I have no idea how to fucking dodge this shit. I'm so mad. I'm just getting owned. Oh no. And he's reversing time in the fucking bubble. You're a bastard. I almost did not parry that. I fucking got hit again. I'm so mad. Oh no, I'm dead. How do you... What? How are you with best before dates? Oh, I'm a bitch. Dude, when it comes to things being expired, if it's past the best before date, it matters what kind of food it is. I couldn't even move! I couldn't even fucking move! Are you kidding me? If... It, it does kind of depend. It does kind of depend the food, but if it's like a dairy or anything that would mold like bread or dairy or something like that, if... If it says... If it says best before, I'll only ever give it one extra day. If it's if it's past if it's past the date by like one, by like two, I, I'm not gonna try it. But like even with milk, like I smell my milk before I pour my milk every single time. If the milk smells off, I don't care if it's like not the expiration date or anything. If it's early, if it doesn't smell if it doesn't smell right, if it smells nasty, it's gone. You know, it's gone instantly. Like if it doesn't smell right, it's gone. Same thing with like anything with anything dairy. I'm like that. I don't really trust the expiration date. <laughs> But things like breads or like canned stuff or whatever, if it's one day after, which rarely happens because I kind of like, I'm really good at like, you know, eating food before it goes bad. But, but if it's like, you know, if it's, if it's like something that, that shouldn't go bad over a long time, like, you know, something canned or something like, you know, like cereal or like, or like fucking ice cream. Or like, you know, if it's like cereal, ice cream, or like chips or whatever, and it's like unopened and it's like one or two days past the expiration date, yeah, it's fine. You know, I'll I'll eat it. I'll try. At least I'll try to eat it. That's right. I can't fucking shoot an arrow. I really want to. Like, I don't fucking know how to. I have to like time my dodge. Yeah, I think I I'm starting to get that. Okay. Enough. Enough. Let's blade. Oh my god, that's still fucking terrifying, dude. This game really makes me want a like a 2D Devil May Cry game though. Oh, that's sick. He has aerial attacks too. That's so fucked up. Oh, my, my hair is annoying me. Give me a moment. Because with Derry, Derry is like used by so so, but also used by five days after opening. Yeah, some people are like that. I can't do that. If it's like five days after opening, or like, you know, or if it's like five days after the expiration date or something, I will not. I will not fucking do it. That's only V. You're a V fan? Oh god. Oh fuck, I double potioned on accident. I was so desperate to use my potion. Whew. Damn, I'm sick. Okay. Okay, reverse time. Oh, I tried. He has a double run Puka now. Oh no. My turn. Oh fuck, I'm getting hit. No, I'm not. Oh, 
fuck. I was doing so well the last time I got to this phase, and now I'm fucked. And he's there. He body blocked me. Oh my god. Cool concept is cool, but he's boring as fuck to play him. Yeah, I think I agree with that. I don't want to like even lose health at the beginning here. It's starting to tilt me. It's like the hardest boss fight in the game so far. I knew he'd be hard though. He's a good fight. I just gotta like focus and not play poorly. Oh my god, I try just kill me. Just kill me. I don't want to spend shit here. But yeah, I think V I think V's cool. I just feel like he's I feel like he's too like not interactive until you have like all of his skills and shit. Like I think he just needs more going for him. Like I don't even mean giving him giving him like a melee option or anything. I just need mean he needs he needs just more things to do. Oh, I parried him with like an attack blow. Really? Unblockable attack while we're mashing you in the corner or Smash Brosing you. Dude, imagine being gay. You could smash your bros while playing Smash Bros like crazy. You know, join join us. Oh, this is fucked. I'm so dead. Okay, I'm not actually so dead. <laughs> be gone. Okay, be gone. Okay, well, at least I'll be safe here. Having to parry attacks is fucking cool. I fucking did not have my dodge! I did not have my dodge, I tried to jump out of that shit and I got fucking true comboed. Oh, you fucking bastard. I tried. I'm out. I'm out, bro. I'm coming! <laughs> fucking A, dude. Bear witness to what? My triumph over you? Dude, this fight is fucking sick. Like, it's hard, which is really good. And I definitely have, like, not a good setup for this, too. <laughs> I had to see it. Like, my build is not good here. Whatsoever. I was gonna bonk him with my shoe. Oh, fuck! I'm getting hit by this. I'm dead. Fucking A, dude! That was... That was such a bad time. I'm dead. Fucker. Dude. I I used my super because I thought and I used the super to gap close into him to do more damage. But the fucking attack that he did still went through. And then that attack put me in the situation where I didn't have like almost I had like no options to run away from his fucking like from his like big attack. Dude, that's fucking crazy. This is main game. This is not DLC at all. Stop. Oh. Teleported to get away from him. I wonder. Yeah, I can't even I can't do a single range attack on him. That's crazy. Oh, he fucking ran pooking me. Like I can't I can sometimes. Okay, I has to be in melee range, though. Yeah, or else he's just gonna like Okay, yeah, and I do not have the time to do that. 
I want to see if I can do a charge attack on him, but... I fucking double potion again? I'm so sick. What happened? Bro pulled me. Oh, I'm, I'm so dead. Oh, I'm so fucked. Okay, I have to be careful here. And then he gets gray health there too, so he starts like, unironically like, just not taking damage. Not taking damage, not not taking damage, sorry. He tar starts, um, fuck, I have to focus. Shit. Okay. Fucker. I just teleporting. Damn. That attack comes so fast. Ugh. I'm just gonna die. <laughs> Kill me fast, please. I'm gonna purposely miss time and miss parries to fucking die. Oh my god, no! I was behind him. I'm trying to do that shit while, um. I should not have fucking tried that. That does not work. And I know that, but I really want to do it. This would be easier if I spec'd in the melee, because he's immune to range. All my ranged abilities deal like extra damage, but he can't, he won't take a single ranged hit. Because he parries all of them, like, innately. Oh, I tried to short hop it and you can't. I should heal. He'll probably do a parryable. Yeah. Okay. I'm getting a good like handle on this fight at this point. But yeah, no, this isn't the DLC is new, and I started it. I beat the first boss of the DLC, and it's kind of like its own thing. It's it's related to the main game sort of, but it definitely is like totally its own thing. Like you basically have to get like new pickups, new new power ups. I took all the damage there. Fuck. Okay, well now he's in like OP mode. Or in phase three, so there he is too. I'm just going to do this. Fuck. I really wanted to get in there. God, that's so fucking cool. Stop. No. Fuck, I dodged that shit. Oh, what? Why was I, like, trapped? My turn. Fuck the double. Oh. oh, you fucker. He has four there. Oh, you dickhead. A fucker. Oh shit, we got out of here. Oh fuck, he actually just like ended there. Oh, he's dead. Let's fucking go. <laughs> shit.
That was fucking sick. No, don't tell me I fucking still lose against this motherfucker. Dude, this game's fucking cool. You will earn the sea How did this shit, like... Then, so many people degree, slept on this shit. I will reveal your regnal name. The story kind of sucks. I'll, I'll be honest. Oh, it's alright. But, like... Our people, I, Darius, have come to present to you my son. So many people talk shit on it, though. The only thing I'm not that into is like the story here. He shall one day become king. It's published by yeah, it's made by Ubisoft. Yeah, published and made. It's like an internal team that made this. The reign of the house of Darius is over. Tomiris, what is this? Oh fuck. Tomiris. No! Ah. That'll be why people shout on it, yeah. People don't like Ubisoft. That's very true. I'm not a fan of Ubisoft either, but if a game's good, a game's good. You must live. Oh. What the fuck? I see. That's weird, but I see. You are the rightful prince. I prefer to leave such meaningless titles to humans. I have left your world behind. That's crazy. The Samorg is no more. It is my sacred duty to recover its powers. For the one who wields them will be equal to a god. You have completely lost your mind, Varum. These powers are mine by right. This is far from over, Sargon. And I hate her. Damn, so I stopped did the she fucking... Betray us? She never did. That doesn't matter anymore. Damn it, she dies too. She was tough on us. And yet, she gave her life. I know what you're thinking. What do you see at the end of your blade? This I the fucking story is shit's corny as fuck. We're flying now? <laughs> Bro, we got super sand powers now. <laughs> Shit. Oh, I absorbed him. Damn. Fix the timeline by absorbing my friend by absorbing myself into my whole being. Is that the solution to the barber's conundrum or whatever? Or the grand is it called the grandfather's paradox, right? Infused with anthra. Oh, cool. Dude, I have a what fucking grappling hook now. Hassan, I have something to tell you, and I need you to believe me. Do those power-ups come to me come with me into the main game? Yes. The power-ups from the DLC, I believe, come into the main game. So like any of the amulets and any of the items and the stuff that I get in the DLC are usable in the main game. But none of the items from the main game are, at least most of them from my knowledge. I might be able to use my amulets and maybe the anthra surges, but I know my health is not there. I know I have to get new health bars in the DLC. Sargon. You are the only one I trust, right? Tamiris, your mother, murdered King Darius. She usurped the throne. The Simorg never perched on her shoulder. Hassan, I'm... I'm sorry. Don't be. I never found she wore her title well. Nor was she... People suffered for 30 years. <laughs> Without the Bro, because of her. Bro's like not even torn up about it, dude. You're, you're just like, yeah, my mom's kind of shit, bro. <laughs> like, <if> I... <laughs> dude, dude's over here, like he's been the prince, he's been in royalty his whole fucking life. It's all a sham. Your your character's like, yeah, no, your your mom's actually a usurper. She's broke the law. We should we should probably go kill your mom and like you know arrest her or something. And he's like, yeah, don't go do it. Who cares? My mom's kind of shit anyway. <laughs> like, what do you fucking mean? 
if somebody broke that news to me about my own mom, about my own life, and shattered it like completely in front of my eyes in like two seconds, I would be kind of devastated. And he's just like, eh, mom was kind of shit anyway. Who cares? I'm sorry about your mentor. <laughs> yeah, I'm speechless too, Sargon. She, me she was following orders from from Tamiris. Then Anahita was manipulated into doing her bidding. Just as I was pressured to maintain faith. Why even have me kidnapped? There's... There's one more thing. I'm listening. Varum is the son of King Darius. Is that... Is that why he tried to kill me? For a... All I know is that all of this has allowed us to see Varum's true colors. Varum may be the rightful heir. But he's far too dangerous. We must stop him. They use the color. They use you for color. That means this game was made by British people. You're right. Or we Canadians. Must protect the people more than anything else. I can help you with what I've learned through scriptures and legends. Because in America, we don't spell color with a U. Usually, most Americans spell with C L C O. Yeah, C L. No, C O L O R. But color in the queen's the queen's english is c o l o u r Varum we're just special powers. that means he's after the heart of the simorg it's at the simorg gate but to gain access you'll need the key of kings fucking americans you knob you fucking bell end over there sizzle you what mate you what sizzle you're helping me you what you want to fucking play battlefield you want to go go meet me in rust 1v1 shipment Mate, I'll fucking own you, mate. You know what I'm saying, mate? Fucking wreck your shit. Straight up. Oh, shit. Yeah, it is a grapple hook. That's sick. <laughs> you have maybe 700 hours in Call of Duty Rust. You you in Modern Warfare? You you got you got that Modern Warfare Rust skill already? Shit. That's fucking cool. Holy shit. I have a fucking, like, get over here button now. Apparently, it can be used for a lot of shit, too. Oh my- He actually reached me. I did not think he'd reach me there. I did not believe it. Oh, if I hold it, I pull things. So I can unlock that secret door now that was over there. I can do all sorts of shit now. We've we've beaten the game. Not really, but we've unlocked a lot of shit. A lot of new stuff, basically. That we can explore. No, you thought I meant the rock naked people rust? Oh, dude, I can't play rust. I get too mad at games like that. I, I like I actually cry like I'll, I'll cry I'll, I'll get I'll especially if, maybe we should stream it because like if I stream it for content I'll be crying and like crying is good for like viewer count right like if I cry I'll get like 50 billion people well like you know it'll be worth <laughs> it'll be worth we'll get donations because people will pity me or something or I'll just be on a cringe compilation somewhere it'd be pretty sick be pretty fucking sick. Oh my. I didn't mean to hit my mic. I'm sorry. Better just a scuff loot in PvP for a day and stop after. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm never I'm I'm not really into those games. I tried playing Ark with Net with Nova for a while and stuff, and it was fun for a little bit, but I'm not like those games just never like work for me menelias ex oh fuck i'm gonna i have all these challenges now to do that that's a battle for next time that's a battle for next time not for today friends not a today battle i don't have enough um i might i might three if i dude if oh, fuck you see you see everything about what i have on my character my my bow is like a huge source of my damage. All my ranged attacks are like a huge source of my damage. So that fight, that fight, I probably would have actually destroyed him really easily if 
if ranged attacks worked on him, but he he just inherently pa parried every ranged attack. So like if I did this, my like my like beam sword that I have, that got instantly parried. Those that beam got instantly parried whenever I did that attack. Whenever I did an arrow attack, it got reflected at me, so I took damage for it. If I did my chakram, my chakram also got parried. So none of my things and I have the I have special amulets that make me like this does this does a beam. That's a special amulet. This this whole like ball sphere thing is also a thing. It's like I could have I could have had such an easier time on him. Oh, it was a fair fight. It definitely was a fair fight. He just he hit really hard. And this isn't even like the hardest difficulty. But he hit really fucking hard. Like, I have a lot of health for this point in the game. I've, I think my completion percentage is going to be like seventy percent when we check it at the end here. So, like, I have most of the, I have most of the health upgrades at this point in the game, and he was still like full comboing me sometimes. He he was if if I fucked up, he could almost like delete my whole health bar in just a combo of attacks, which is fucking crazy. It, it felt it felt pretty fair still because like I shouldn't have been getting caught like that. You know, it's it's one of those things where it's like I I know I could just be like, just don't be there. Don't get caught and don't get caught. Don't get fucked. But yeah, it was it was a good boss fight. I like that. Overall, it was good. His damage was kind of high, though, and made made things kind of hard on me. But that's kind of like the price you pay, right? He, he wouldn't be a hard boss fight if he didn't hit me hard, so. Good to see you. Boss trials? Warning, some amulets cannot be boss revenge. Fight against once defeated bosses at any difficulty? Oh. No hit. No hit. I forget what difficulty I'm on, but yeah. I can choose. There are some amulets they think are overpowered. Holy shit. Greatly increased attack power. Blessing. That's what I'm using. I'm using blessing because it gives me a little bit more health. But most of my build is fine. That's crazy. Boss rush. Complete all main quests to unlock this game mode. Challenges. I have to finish this challenge eventually. I have like t a couple more things. There's another thing still. Holy fuck. There's more. There's more shit to learn. These are all like tutorials that give you a little bit of like souls, but damn. What a fucking game. I feel like I've explored everywhere too. I know I'm going to have to go here. I think that's going to unlock the royal corridors. Well, the royal corridors are probably here. I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to go there immediately. I think I'll be able to. I can go here now. I can get that item. That's for sure. I can definitely get everything. I think I can basically get everything now. I think we're okay. Uh-huh. There's that secret. What was this again? I forget. I wasn't able to figure out this one either. That was weird. That was a weird little, little, little thing. Yeah, I could go here. I have a lot of places to go now. Oh, there's a secret here that I was supposed to get. Let me go get that one before I forget. Do you remember where you have or you haven't been? Um, yeah, I do. I have a rough I have a rough memory of it. I feel like the next parts of this game are all gonna be like more or less like boss rushing or like cleaning up you know, secrets here and there. What the fuck? There ain't no way. Okay. <laughs> that's so fucked up. That's so that's 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 silly. <laughs> it's silly. But yeah, I have a good I have a good memory. And the map the map's pretty good, so I really like the whole picture thing. 
if I buy the um, whenever I buy the maps from the girl for like the treasure maps, the map it marks where the items are too, which is cool. You don't have to buy the treasure maps, but I have. It says the catacombs. It says I can't get the catacomb stuff. The game keeps lying to me. Oh, I can get over here too. We've unlocked some secrets. I. <laughs> We not that we've unlocked secrets, but I remember the um I, I know how to get through them now. And these these doors are pretty simple. They're just there. Because your memory's awful with things like that. Dude, that's why I, <clears throat> that's why I've been praising this game about some of the shit that it's done, because like in games like this, my usual problem is that especially like when I played Animal Well, right? It, <laughs> that's sick. What the fuck am I supposed to do? It's crazy. Oh, ricochet. That's really fun. <laughs> Make it clean, dude. But the um But when it comes to games like this, like being able to like set markers and shit or to like, you know, like take pictures of stuff. Like here I have like a marker. To like remind me of what where it was, right? And then I can remove it now that I've been there. Like that that's all you need in games like this, like are markers or things that can like give you a hint. And Animal Wall had markers, but this game also has pictures you can take. And being able to take pictures to know where you're like where you've been and like what like you're thinking about, or like if you're like, oh, this is a puzzle, but like I don't know how to fucking solve it right now. Like you can just take a picture of it. And then you're good. Like, if if you don't know how to solve it at the moment, you can just take a picture of it, leave it, come back later, or maybe even just look at the puzzle when you have like new abilities and be like, oh yeah, I figured this out. Let me go back to the puzzle and try to try again. You know, whatever. Like that's such a nice thing that it makes it makes it so it makes this game a lot more like just friendly to try and be oh this is gonna be like a combat encounter isn't it no huh okay I felt like that's gonna be a combat encounter thanks for the collectible item master the white lion is trying to Trying to kill me. Okay. But it says like it says there's an item here. And also I'm kind of trapped. Oh, okay. Another secret. But there's an item there. Hmm. Huh. Yeah, I know. It says there's an item here, like a treasure chest. The pictures should have been a selling point. Dude, like, actually, though, it's fucking crazy. It's crazy how nice they are to have. Hmm. I have no idea. I, I yeah, I have no idea, man. I feel like it has to do with this tile here. It's like my thought is like I think it has to do with this tile. Maybe if I just like crouch on it for like a minute. <laughs> no, yeah, no, I think it has to do with this tile. Or this tile. Maybe both of them. I like do this. No. Huh. There's no hint. As well. I'll have to come back then. I can't figure. I, I don't know. I'm like lost. I thought it would be easy, but it's not. Great. <laughs> Great, dude. Well, that works for me. 
but yeah, I think that's going to be it for me for today. I think I'm going to I think I'm going to check our progress and then I think I'm calling it for the night. I need to go to bed and do stuff. <laughs> I I need to do stuff today, Sizzle. I've been useless. I went I was going to go out to go get my my like letters, right? Like from the mailbox. And then there were a bunch of tarantulas like outside of my apartment complex. And uh, I don't fuck with spiders like that, so <laughs> I just said no. I just said no. And I went back inside and I said I'm staying inside today. So I'm gonna try and go I'm gonna try and go outside and hopefully the tarantulas are gone. And if they're not gone, um I'm going to bed. <laughs> I'm I'm I need to sleep. I need to do stuff. I, I need to like what have I not done today? I've done I've done quite a bit today actually, but I have I have some chores I want to complete before I go to bed. Oh, I can't get the catacomb treasure map. Cool, let me save here. Talk to the tree. But on that note, thanks everybody for watching. Thanks for being here. If you're new around the YouTube or whatever, wherever you are, new on the Twitch, new on the YouTube, make sure you follow, subscribe, whatever, stuff like that. I know you're beautiful people. And thank you guys so much for the support because the YouTube has been like, the YouTube has been nuts lately. Yeah, 72%. Holy shit. There's, there's not much. There's, there's not much more at this point, is there? Because so that's, yeah, that's like almost 100% of the game. <laughs> that's three quarters of the game done. And I have like maybe two more powers to unlock. So... We're, we're doing work. This game's almost complete. But yeah, thanks everybody for being here. Peace.